Welcome to the Canadian Rocky Mountains of Alberta. In this video, we'll learn several tips for driving the DT12 automated manual transmission in winter conditions. We will also overview how the DT12 operates in various terrains in winter weather and how to get the safest driving experience. The DT12 is designed to automatically shift based on your throttle input, giving you flexibility for fuel economy and performance. The shift stock will also respond differently based on your inputs. This is important to consider when driving in slippery conditions. And as always, light, gentle input is safer than hard inputs. The launching process should be very similar to operating a manual transmission. Apply minimal throttle to launch and maintain speed, which prevents wheel spin. The auto select start gear may need to be upshifted by pulling on the shift lever before liftoff to minimize wheel spin or power delivered to the axles at part throttle. Using creep mode is a great option in this type of scenario. It will get the vehicle moving with limited torque. The interaxle differential lock should be engaged when encountering snow covered terrain before wheel spin is experienced, especially before pulling grades. Differential locks should be disengaged when descending a grade. Rocking the vehicle is acceptable to get out of a stuck situation. Pay close attention to any clutch overheating or abuse. Automatic traction control, ATC, can be turned off in this scenario. Certain tactics should be used based on terrain and wintry conditions. Let's look at some safe ways to traverse grades in snow or ice. In flat terrain, creep mode is the best way to get moving, and speed can be controlled with the shift stock. Once moving, light throttle will engage regular drive mode. Automated mode will select the appropriate gear, but you can still hold gears or request shifts manually using the shift stock. A partial throttle approach will minimize skip shifting with the DT12. Automatic traction control will apply brakes to slipping wheels and engine torque will be reduced. When ABS or ATC is active, automated downshifts will not occur. When climbing a grade, apply only enough throttle to maintain a safe speed. If your speed remains consistent, automated shifting will be limited. You can still hold gears or request shifts manually using the shift stock. If ABS or ATC activates, automated downshifts will not occur. And finally, when descending a grade, using engine brakes is not recommended. DT12 engine brakes can force a downshift depending on the shift stock position when in automated mode. If engine braking is required in non-optimal road conditions, position one should be utilized along with the service brake. Position two could request a downshift based upon speed and application of the service brake. Never use position three as it will downshift the transmission. Apply light service brake to prevent gaining momentum or entering e-coast. If ABS or ATC activates, automated downshifts will not occur. After an ABS event, there is a time delay before automatic shifts occur. By adhering to the driving tips on the DT12 automated manual transmission, you can have confidence when driving in various terrains and wintry conditions you'll get the safest driving experience while maintaining the flexibility for fuel economy and performance.